Let's talk a little bit further about what position is the knee in that actually causes the ACL injury to occur. In order to do that, we use the word mechanism of injury. All that means is in what position is the knee in or, or what vulnerable position is the knee in for the actual injury to occur itself. So looking down at the foot first and foremost, we see that that foot is firmly planted. Going up, you kind of look at what's going on with the knee. You can kind of see that the knee falls in. That's what we describe as dynamic valgus. And dynamic valgus is actually a combination of a couple of things. So firstly, when we look at what's considered the tibia or the shin bone, that tibia is actually what we consider to be abducted. So it means moving away from midline. In combination with that, we see what's going on looking at the hip. The hip or the femur is actually adducting or moving closer to midline or falling inside of that line. The combination of the adducted hip and the abducted tibia causes that inward movement of the knee and that's what we describe as dynamic valgus. So the last thing in this video that I want to describe is what's going on from the waist up. What's happening here is you see a major lean of the trunk toward the side of the injury. 